Okay, I'm gonna show you how to install CFG. So first of all, you need to have Homebrew Channel. And if you don't, you can go figure out how to get it. Okay, we're gonna go in this Homebrew. Then we're gonna go into Wii Mod. Okay, and we're gonna go to Wad Manager. And then you're gonna click the SD slot. And then you're gonna navigate down to Channels. And then you're gonna go down to the USB Lower CFG. You're gonna click on that. And you're gonna click A. And give it a second. And then it'll finish, you just press any button, and we're done here. And then you just press the home button on the remote, and it should take you back to the homebrew channel. And you just hit the home button, and go to the system menu. Then we're going to check out our CFG loader. As you can see, it now has CFG. We're going to navigate here. Okay. And then we're going to pick a game here. We got Smash Brothers. Run a little Smash. And the game's going to boot. Just give it a second. You're going to get to this screen. Just allow it to do what it does. Don't press anything. Okay. As you can see, we got the game nice and loaded. And as usual, you can use a classic remote, remote control with all the GameCube games. Okay, and if you want to exit here and go back to the home screen, all you got to do is hit the home button. And it'll reset the Wii. Take you back to the home screen, and you can start from wherever you want, and you're all set to go.